Welcome to the video on P-Charts. You can use P-Charts to monitor the proportion of defective items, when each item can be classified into one of two categories, such as pass or fail, or go no go. P-Charts monitor the process stability over time and help you to identify and correct instabilities in your process. For example, the supervisor for a call center wants to evaluate the process for answering customer phone calls. She records the total number of incoming calls and the number of unanswered calls. Then she creates a P-chart to monitor the proportion of unanswered calls. To create a P-chart in Minitab statistical software, choose Stat. Control Charts Attributes Charts P in variables, enter unanswered calls. In subgroup sizes, enter total calls. Select P chart options. On the tests tab, select test one and test two. In this case, you're not sure which tests apply. So use tests one and two to first establish the control limits based on your data. Select okay in each dialog. The chart shows that, on average, 9.57% of calls are unanswered. None of the subgroup proportions are outside of the control limits. The points inside the limits display a random pattern. This p-chart does not provide any evidence for lack of control. Traditional p-charts assume that your rate of defectives is constant over time. However, sometimes external noise factors that are not special causes may affect the rate of defectives. If your data exhibit more or less variation than expected over time, a Laney P prime may more accurately distinguish between common cause variation and special cause variation than a traditional P chart. Let's look at a traditional P chart compared to a Laney P prime chart of the same data. On this traditional P chart, the large subgroup sizes result in very narrow control limits. With the narrow control limits, Overdispersion causes several of the subgroups to appear out of control. The Laney P prime chart, however, corrects for overdispersion and shows that the process is actually in control. To learn what kind of P chart makes sense for your data, use the P chart diagnostic test in Minitab. The results will clearly show if you should use a traditional P chart or a Laney P prime chart to monitor defectives. To learn more about how you can use Minitab products, go to minitab.com.